Hi, and welcome back to another Valiant Technology Quick Byte. In this video, we're going to demonstrate how to turn on multi-factor authentication for your Office 365 account. Start by getting logged into your Office 365 account in the browser. If you're already logged in, you can do this from any page, but I'm starting at office.com. Go to the top right corner and click on your icon. It might be just your initials, or it could be a picture that you've selected. From there, click View Account. This will bring up your account settings. To turn on multi-factor authentication, you want to go to Security Info. So you can either go to this box here and click Update Info, or over on the left menu, you can click Security Info from here. Right on this page, you'll see the methods that you use to sign into your account or reset your password. If you don't already have a cell phone set up, you can click Add Method. Otherwise, go over to your cell phone section and click Enable Two-Step Verification. Enter in the phone number that you would like to use. I recommend using Text Me a Code and then click Next. This will send a six-digit code to your cell phone. Just enter in the code here and click Next. Done. My phone was registered successfully. Now every time you want to log in from a new location, you'll receive a text message and you'll have to enter that code. However, we at Valiant recommend a different factor for your multi-factor authentication that provides more security than just SMS messaging. To use this from the same security info page, press Add Method. The default will be Authenticator app, and that's the one we want you to pick. Click Add, then it will tell you to get the app on your phone. You can use Microsoft Authenticator, or if you already have an Authenticator app on your phone, that one will work as well. You would just have to press, I want to use a different Authenticator app. But let's go through this like we're using Microsoft Authenticator. Download the app from either the Google Play Store or the App Store for iPhone. Click Next when your phone is ready. Then you'll have to follow the prompts on your phone in the Authenticator app. This will include clicking Add Account, selecting Work or School, and entering your login credentials, email and password. When you're ready, click Next, and a QR code will appear on your computer. The application on your phone will be ready to scan that barcode. Just point it at the screen and let it do its magic. Your phone will be all set up, and you just have to click Next here. If you're using Microsoft Authenticator, it will send you a push notification, which you'll have to approve in order to move forward. Now that you're all set up, you can always make changes by going back to the Security Info section in your Microsoft account. You can also shore up the security on other accounts using your Authenticator app to enable multi-factor authentication. For more tips and useful how-tos, subscribe to our YouTube channel or visit us at thevaliantway.com slash KB. Bye-bye.